Where's the road? We have to cross here. No. Probably over there. I'd say. Good morning internet, it is 7.20 in the morning and welcome back to the channel. It is now the really time to leave Zimapan here in Mexico. I am off my merry way and well, Alaska is ready for it. So all that is left is to show you on the map what the plan is for today and then quickly go because guess what, today is another long day. Okay, so Zimapan, Zimapan. The plan for today is I want to ride to San Miguel de Allende, which is over here. But instead of going straight, I will have to cross these mountains here. So I will be riding through the mountains here and here and then continue to San Miguel. So I think, well, I think it's a little bit shorter than all those 400 kilometer rides. I think this one is about 350. So it should be easily doable, hopefully. Okay. Yeah, 347 kilometers. So. There we go. The moon is still out. Can you see it? It's hiding behind the cloud there. Lost right through the cute little city center of Simapan. Oh, it's a stunning sunrise. Just behind those clouds over there. Good morning, Mexico. Look at that, there's a lake there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I see it on my GPS now as well. That's a huge lake. Oh, it's full of algae. You see those uh, green layers on top. Look at this. This must be the gorge where I was in the last video. But then uh, a little further down. Oh, it's amazing, huh? <laughs> Look at this. That's rock face, wow. Now we're going to do another tunnel. Buenos dias. Adios. Those were really good. They remind me a little bit of uh, the pupusas that you get in El Salvador a lot and in Honduras. They're kind of like stuffed, stuffed tortillas. Very nice and a good coffee, <laughs> which is not so easy to find around here. 
You know, this is something that I really like about Mexico, is that this morning, you know, I was riding through these barren almost mountains, and what is it? 50 kilometers later, or maximum 100 kilometers later, and you're riding through, well, what are these, pine forests? Still in the mountains, but lush and green again. I don't know if you can see that, but right in between those mountains, just behind there, I think there's another canyon of some sort. And now, of course, I'm wondering, <laughs> am I gonna go in that direction? Seems like it. So. I think I need to keep two hands at the handlebar. I guess I will find out. A little peek at the view. Spectacular. <laughs> hey, look what we have here. Those are the mountains I was pointing at earlier that still seemed very far away. And I can see there's some villages down below there. But luckily, I'm riding up here with amazing views and no towns. Oh, here you can see it even better. <laughs> yeah. Gorgeous, right? This is another gem of a ride. I think I'll be riding uh, that road all the way down there. See that on that mountain? <laughs> Absolutely nobody here except for a few lost cows every now and then. They all look very 
Kiski. This is more uh, terrain that the goats can still eat, like all these plants. Cows, I guess they need a little bit more grass. Not a farmer. What do I know? I know nothing. Looks like I'm heading straight for that little oasis again. It looks like there's a massive, what is it, fort? Or I don't know what that is. Let's find out. I've descended uh, more than a kilometer, more than a thousand meters already. Still going down. Very bumpy. Tilt covering the rocks. It's a bit tricky. Entering a tiny canyon now. It looks a bit. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. What a ride! Look at this. Here are the goats. I knew they had to be somewhere. <laughs> so maybe I wasn't totally blabbing nonsense. I go these. Aren't you the goat uh, dog? Oh. <laughs> Hola! Buenas! Are you now my, are you my friend or are you going to attack? Huh? Not sure. Hey, buddy! You have to run all the way back, you know. He's leaving up. Ah, 
yeah, finally I've reached the river. Oh, I have to cross it also. Somewhere. Oh, where's the road? Do I have to cross here? No. Probably over there, I'd say. too far. That's the road. Oh, okay. Uh, or no, just straight there. Probably. I think so, yeah. Doesn't look very deep. Oh. <laughs> uh, not so deep, yeah. track I hear something ticking something is loose somewhere not sure what I dropped Alaska on her side just before in the canyon. It was just <laughs> it was really stupid. I wasn't even riding. I stopped to take some pictures and as I tried to get back up I lose balance and I drop Alaska right against this uh, rock face. So silly. That might have caused a little bit of damage again. <laughs> but I am not going to let it spoil my ride because it's flippin' awesome! <laughs> Look where I'm riding! Is this just the best? Look at that. Again, this from my little drop. Oh, hey! I'm finally arriving at that place I saw from the distance. The little green oasis with the with the fort. Oh, actually, I think it is a fort <laughs> or or something rather. Oh, look at this! It is incredible.
Let's have a quick look. What is Ex Convento de Bucarelli. Ja, yeah, convent. So, uh, monastery. Pretty good location for a monastery. It is uh, too hot to stop and uh, walk around. I gotta keep on moving. But uh, looks pretty old. Let's say here. I can't believe people live here. Unbelievable. What a location. Well, I guess the people that live here, I don't think they leave town just to uh, go to the shop or something. They live pretty, pretty remote out here. Unreal. Town is a proper mission. Slowly but gradually, I'm climbing out of the out of the gorge. Well, actually, not slowly and gradually, quite rapidly. <laughs> See, I was down below. Already here. Wow, it is a uh, very slow progress. It's 12 o'clock and I still have 200 kilometers to go. So let me think. I left 750. I stopped for to have a breakfast, 20 minutes maybe. Uh, it took me four hours to do 150 kilometers. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, slow going. Finally reached the paved road again. So now I can actually make some progress. in San Miguel de Allende. I'm here. Woo. Quickly find a place to stay. Very 
very cute place, isn't it? Okay, somewhere here. Should be a hotel or something. Hola. ¿Cómo está? Um, estoy buscando una habitación. There's a parking. And I got a little paper so I can show that I paid. Okay. I'm so dusty and dirty. Be fine. This is kind of a private parking. Oh, oh man, I'm knackered. I'm knackered. What a long day, but uh, it was amazing. Again, just uh, the scenery in Mexico is just blowing me away every time now. It's really, really oh, amazing riding. What else can I say? So, this town, San Miguel de Allende, has a lot of. Uh, hello. No, I'm from Hotel Catalina. Oh, I put okay. the paper. Okay. He's checking on me. Um, so, um, what was I saying? Yeah, this town has a lot of historical buildings and I think it's a colonial town. But anyway, for now I'm not going to do anything. <laughs> I'm going to find a place to get my laundry done, that sort of thing. Oh, you can already see. See that kind of pink thing there? So yeah, probably a lot to see building-wise here, but uh, I don't know. I don't know yet where I'm gonna go from here anyway. So tomorrow I'm going to use to get stuff done like laundry and uh, kind of figure out where I'm gonna go from here. But for now, I am finished. So that was it for today. I really hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and then I'll see you in the next video.